Imagine for a moment that one thing that you want in your life, whatever it is, that goal, that dream. We talked about this last week. Imagine it for a moment. It's awesome. It's awesome. Whatever it is. Now all you need is a way to make it happen. But without what we're going to talk about today on The Midnight American, it's likely no plan will work. There are so many systems and processes and strategies, you know, packages you can buy. It's here. Oh, my new life begins. I'm going to live in a mansion. I'm going to own a Lamborghini. I'm going to be rich and famous and I'm going to have six-pack apps. Mind games that you can play on yourself. Books you can read. All kinds of stuff out there to help you build a system that allow you to achieve just about any goal, right? And many of these tactics and systems and products actually work until they don't. Ooh, it got complicated. You know, it really, it really stifled my lifestyle. It's so boring. Mm, something's pinching me in my back. Yeah, you really should lay off that for a while. It's not really working with my schedule too well. I found this new and improved, much better program. I think this one's the real deal. I mean, I can't really talk about it right now. My attorney says not until after the trial. That's the thing about an excuse. It doesn't need to be a good one. It just needs to be there. The mind ad adapts. That vehicle to success loses its new car smell. It's no longer new and fun and exciting anymore. Another thing that doesn't work. Hmm. Because it was never really about the mechanism. It wasn't about what we were doing. It wasn't the plan. The system was fine. It was about something else that didn't come in the box. It's spiritual faith, self-discipline, and focus. There's no magic pill or online hack for this. Without these principles, you'll never stick to a system or a process or a program or a plan or anything else long enough to develop it into the habitual acts needed to create lasting long-term effects. So let's break down each one, right? Okay, one, spiritual fortitude. This is the courage that's called up through a higher realm of consciousness in the face of pain and adversity. Strength through prayer, through meditation, where we align our personal intentions, our goals, our aspirations, and everything with a cosmic force. With that feeling of divine strength within us, we tend to take action on things that we might not otherwise do. Discipline. Discipline just means that we structure our days and our time to kill all excuses, period. Okay, regardless of how good they are, and man, we can always come up with some good ones if we need to, right? We show up no matter what. We force the action to happen. May the force be with you. We review what we did. We improve on it. We take new action and we repeat that over and over and over again until we build it into a routine and an ironclad habit. And three, we focus. This means that our plan, whatever it is, always sees the goal, right? All action advances towards the goal. It means that when we fail, we always fail forward and fail and fall towards the goal with a clear vision in mind. We just keep falling and failing and moving and doing forward. It's gonna be a blast, man. Well, now we're talking. It's gonna be fun. And sometimes it's not. Sometimes it's gonna be work. And sometimes work is just work. And that's when you gotta be careful, right? because that's when temptation and distractions, they're gonna move into your life and they're gonna attack you from all corners of the universe. Get all of that garbage, all of those distractions, all of those that negative energy out of your space, out of your mind, out of your place and get present and clear and mindful in the moment. Through what? Through meditation, through a connection to a higher source, through a divine intelligence. I know it's woo-woo. This just in, science contradicts and rejects this claim. Back to the studio. And you can believe whatever you want, but believe me, if you stay loyal to your principles, that spiritual faith, the self-discipline, you stay focused, you will move through each measured step of your program with so much more intention. Your steps will make progress. Your time 
will be valued. The work will be more productive and fun. And for once, that system, process, strategy, nine-step program, whatever it is, might honestly offer you better, faster, longer-lasting results, guaranteed. Awesome, awesome. Thank you so much for joining me here at the Dirt Capsule Studio. And I love that you watched the video all the way to this point. Please subscribe, comment, share with your friends or anyone that you think might get some value. And until next time, know yourself better than you know anyone else.